What is good to all my nasty ass wrestlers? If you guys don't know me, my name's Isaac and I post a new video here on my wrestling channel every single day. So if you like this video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. And if you haven't already checked it out, I posted a 200 sub giveaway. I'm giving away a free pair of wrestling shoes. You guys should definitely check that out. I'm putting a card like right here. As you can tell by the title of my video, this is how to deal with lazy partners, okay? This is pretty simple. It's, it's a problem that I ran into a lot when I was in high school. And so, like, what's going on, right? You're wrestling, and this kid, he just does not put any effort into like anything. Like he lets you take him down, he lets you take two, he lets you turn him and like, he's just not putting effort in, right? First things first, you need to talk to him. You need to communicate with this kid because like just jumping to step two is gonna be terrible. It'll cause a fight. You need to talk to him and tell him that you want resistance, that you want to use everybody in the room as a tool to make yourself better and then you're not putting up with this bullshit of having this kid be soft and try to make you soft. Cause that's what he's trying to do. He's trying to make you as soft as he is by making you lazy. But that's how I think of it. That's what's in my head when I'm like, this kid is not working with me. Why, why isn't he working with me? When you're in the wrestling room, you're there to work. You're there to grind. You're there to get better. You're there to get faster. If you do that every single day, you will be 10 times better than these other kids. These kids who just like lounge around and are lazy, right? But you need to tell your partner you can't let him just go on thinking that it's okay to be lazy in practice because practice is for no reason right a lot of kids in high school think that practice is pointless they think that they can just skip practice and bullshit you cannot be skipping practice like that is insane it is insane to me that kids skip practice but sure enough we always had someone i don't know how you skip a practice that's immediately after school so you need to talk to them so if you have been very clear with them that you want them to fight back that you want them to try to beat you up in a wrestling match right throughout the whole practice. Now this isn't if they're cutting weight and they're tired. This is if they're just being lazy. So if talking to them doesn't work, then you need to show them the hard way, right? You need to start making them work. You need to push your partner until they feel like they're drowning. You cannot be letting up on them. You have to make them fight back. You have to make like feel that fear of like they're just getting the shit kicked out of them. They're having their head banged down. They're getting double leg. They're getting like, they're just getting like cross faced and make it a not fun experience experience you have to be a dick you have to not let this kid ignore the fact that you're wrestling right now that this is two humans going after each other this is two people literally like clashing this is not an easy sport this is not this is not a relaxing sport this is not like this is a very hard sport this is a very hard sport that takes a lot of effort with very little rewards but the rewards are totally worth it so if you're willing to put the work in then you can get their best rewards the, the people who are at the highest level are there because they have worked the hardest right and you will not get there with a lazy partner so you have to nip that shit in the bud you cannot let that happen and worst case scenario absolute worst case scenario you need to tell your coach and get a new partner never let anyone else drag you down ever ever always reach your full potential never care about anyone else will obviously have relationships with people but like in your pursuit to greatness don't care about anyone else does that make sense all right if you guys like my video hit the like button hit the subscribe button enter into that giveaway i'm picking the winner saturday i'm posting the video sunday so you have until saturday today is april 23rd monday i'll see you guys tomorrow peace